In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up ACH e-mandate for your HDFC home loan. If your home loan is approved, you will get a mail HDFC facility of ACH e-mandate with your loan account number. In the mail, you need to click on this link. A new tab will open up. Over there, you can see portal.hdfc.com ACH mandate. Click on get started and click on next and click on register now and enter the loan account number, date of birth, click on submit and select the OTP method. I'm selecting email. Click on send OTP. You will get the OTP to your registered email address or mobile number. Enter the OTP. Click on submit. Click on I confirm that either or both access rights are available to my registered account. Now over here you will be shown account number, borrower name, EMI type and the EMI amount. And from the left side menu you need to select the strike date. It will show you the available preferred strike dates you need to select the strike date the strike date is nothing but the day on which the EMI amount will be deducted from your savings account and after that you need to select the first collection date I am selecting 25th September and after that you need to choose your bank account currently it doesn't have a IFSC code so I am going to click on this pencil icon and enter the IFSC code of your branch after entering the IFSC code click on submit now here you can see that choose the sharing percentage between your bank accounts I am giving 100% and after that choose the authentication type you can authenticate this using net banking or debit card I am going with net banking and after that on the right side you need to select the borrower contact details you need to select the email id and the mobile number and click on submit you need to accept the terms and conditions and click on submit here you can see that message redirecting to bank and over here you can see the e-mandate registration form scroll down you need to accept the terms and conditions and click on submit i have selected net banking as the authentication method so i need to log in to the net banking account now your otp will be sent to your registered mobile number you need to enter the otp and click on continue after successful authentication with the otp you will get this message ach e-mandate registration success registration was successful details will be sent through sms and email so that's it guys hope you like this video please do subscribe to our channel thank you